but he came back looking like he'd been sleeping on the streets of Miami. He would sit glued to one spot for hours, chain smoking cigarettes all day and staring off into space. Unusual behavior, wouldn't you say? Well, he may have left part of his mind in Miami, but he sure didn't leave any of his appetite. <laughs> what hadn't changed was he was still eating us out of house and home like he always had. You know, we never found out what happened to my brother while he was in Miami. The saying goes that lightning doesn't strike twice in the same place, but I beg to differ because in my family, it struck three times. You see, my oldest brother became acutely ill with a bleeding ulcer and refused the necessary surgery that he needed to correct the problem. He instead chose to suffer in silence, becoming extremely depressed. One day, he just snapped and was threatening to hit my mama with a two by four. I ended up taking the blow for her and he better be glad because if he would have hit my mama with that two by four, he was going to find out firsthand the meaning of I brought you in this world.